Hi Star Wars fans, Universal Collector here. We have a new video today. We are looking at the vintage Palatoya X-Wing fighter with Pilot. <laughs> yeah, this is a uh, great looking uh, vehicle. One of, those, one of those vintage things that most people want to own. There's our Luke X-Wing giving us a wave. Still in quite a nice condition, still fairly white. These go quite yellow. And this is the uh, Sailor Palatoy version. It's got no electrics at all in it. No sounds, no, uh, no laser at the front. They all stripped all that out for the Palatoy. They made it a bit more simpler. Um, and but they gave us the uh, they gave us the chrome R2 head, which is quite nice. Yeah. So we have a. I'll take him out and we'll have a look. Camera do down. There we go. There's the canopy just got this recently to finish it off I had another canopy in there but it was a tinted one this is the original it's a bit yellow but um, it's all original now I've been trying to put this together for years so yeah so you've got folding on the carriage so you can have it into fly mode then of course There we go. S falls to att attack position. So that's in flying mode. What you do is you push down on there and say so you've got the release. They didn't bother with any undercarriage on the back, they just had these sort of extra bits to the engine. She fold that down for landing position. On the back, we got the old sticker on the back. On the Amer on the uh, Kenner version, this had a detailed bit of plastic added on. It comes with these cannons that come off pretty easily. He's always bent. It's not pretty good. These are in pretty good condition. So you just do the old trick, find these bent, put them in hot water, supple them up and then put them, get them straight and then put them straight in the cold water. They usually hold their position. You get two, two of these are uh, on the famous Palatoy cardboard Death Star. go you know you've got a good canopy if you lift it up and it stays in the upright position and we've got the uh, flight deck nothing much inside just the seat I'll put a pilot in There we go, Luke's in, got that closed. Another reason, you know, if you've got a good canopy, if you turn it upside down, it doesn't drop out. There we go, locks in pretty well. When I uh, got this, I um, this was pretty much scratched. So uh, some good advice, so I use this, which is Novus. You get three different grades, you know, one, two, three. This is two for fine. You get three, which is the really deep ones and very fine scratches, but this stuff's brilliant. It's like a sort of a creamy stuff. You just brush it on, you know, just rub it all over it, let it to dry and polish and buff the hell out of it. 
you know, sometimes you have to give it a couple of goes you can get a very sm small drill with a buffing end and just keep going at it and i've done it and it was amazing it looks so much it's a bit yellow but that's because of his age yeah this is awesome <clears throat> you don't find i just say you just do not see many of this this white anymore and i don't condone peroxide in it or anything like that that's just this is the way it is yeah it's great little uh vehicle and i'm happy i've uh, completed it now go back in the collection oh, yeah there we go uh, thanks for watching please uh, like and subscribe and uh, leave some comments and i'll leave you uh, see you on the next video see you later bye